Why does the ancient portal lead us here? Have the Shivans been waiting for us for thousands of years? This odyssey, this exodus. Do we journey toward the promised land or into the Valley of the Kings? Three decades ago, I envisioned a new future for our species. And now that we are on the brink of realizing my dream, I feel only solitude and regret. Has my entire life's work been a fool's crusade? Have I led my people into this desert only to die? My regime has caused nothing but savagery and suffering, but I cannot turn back now. I must find the destroyers that lurk behind this veil of clouds. Or I must wait for the destroyers to find me. The nebula is a remnant of a supernova thousands, if not billions of light years from Earth. And I wonder now if our ancestors witnessed the death of this star, erupting over an Egyptian landscape, blazing with the brilliance of 400 million suns. Even in their divinity, no pharaoh could have imagined this. Alpha-1, you will pilot a new Star-class stealth fighter. Your mission is to scan the subsystems of the Savannah's Juggernaut. Allied intelligence has requested data regarding the navigation, weapons, sensors, and communication subsystems of the warship. To scan a subsystem, you must first select it with the subsystem targeting control, then close to 150 meters to scan. The lead indicator must be in the center of your reticle. Maintain that position until the scan indicator has moved across your target view. Average scanning time is 5 seconds. The design of the stealth fighter will minimize your EM signature. Though we have not tested the stealth fighter against Sheevan targets, avoid flying into the line of sight of enemy fighters, and keep moving as much as possible. The longer you stay in one position, the greater your risk of detection. Firing weapons will also reveal your position. To create a diversion, the GVCB Mahas will direct an assault toward the stern of the warship. This will draw enemy fire away from you and the systems you must target. The Savannah has a smaller concentration of turrets in this quadrant, but you must complete your mission quickly. The Corvette will not last long against the Juggernaut. The Mahes has already engaged the Savannah. You have to move quickly. The systems you need to scan are listed in the director's window. Target the subsystem and close to within 150 meters. You must have a direct line of sight to the subsystem to scan it properly. If the subsystem is not in view, it will be marked with a diamond on your hood. The subsystem's lead indicator must also be in your reticle. The average scanning time is 5 seconds. If the scan cycle is aborted, you will have to make another attempt. 
House of Terran. Though the certain technical command had its doubts, our deployment of the Tog class stealth fighter was successful. Against difficult odds, you acquired subsystem scans of the Sheep and Juggernaut. GTVI analysts are now reviewing the data, searching for a weakness in the Juggernaut's defenses. Once intelligence completes its report, Allied Command will outline our strategy for neutralizing the Savannah's threat. Your attack against the turrets of the Savannah's has yielded important data regarding the relative strength of the Juggernaut's weapons. This information should be useful. The Falcon's video is captured and the 